You've probably heard about Janome's AccuFeed feet. Let me show you a little bit about how they work and the differences between the AccuFeed feet and a walking foot. And I'll also walk you through some of the different options that we have available for our AccuFeed feet. First off, you've probably seen this foot before. It's a standard walking foot. We also sometimes call it an even feed foot. The way that this foot works is this lever right here sits on top of the needle bar when you put it on your machine. And anytime the needle goes up and down, the needle bar goes up and down and this tells the even feed foot to raise and lower the extra set of teeth that are on the top of your machine. This is great because having this extra set of teeth on the top of your feet that works with the feed dogs that are on the bottom of your machine, it really helps you move fabric through more evenly. So this is our standard even feed foot with the needle bar that goes up and down. But let me show you a little bit about how the AccuFeed feet work. This right here is our standard AccuFeed foot. And let me show you how to take off the standard foot and ankle that comes on the machine and attach your AccuFeed foot. And the way that this one works is it still has the teeth that are engaged when you're stitching, but instead of a bar, you can see there's no bar on it that sits on the needle bar and just goes up and down when the, the needle goes up and down to engage the teeth. We actually have this little hook right here. And this little hook right here, when you put the foot and attach it to your machine, it goes into a little spot on the back of the machine. And this is a great feature to have. Uh, how that works is once we put this hook in, instead of the needle and the going up and down when the teeth go up and down and those just moving together, you can actually feed through these teeth a little bit better because we can tell how much fabric is pulled through with this machine. On the side of the machines that have the AccuFeed foot available for it, there is a knob. And by adjusting that knob, you can adjust how much of a bite those top feed um, are giving as you're going through the machine. And you can adjust that for your exact purposes and what you're needing. The other great thing that I love about our AccuFeed feet is that they have interchangeable feet on them. So you're not stuck with like um, the even feed foot, just having kind of an extra uh, standard A foot on there. You can use many different feet. So this feet foot probably looks pretty similar to your standard A foot. And this is kind of the standard AccuFeed foot that we have, but you can very easily pop that off and attach one of our other feet. So let me walk you through some of the other feet that we have. This is your standard sewing foot, but you can see that it's got that open toe right here. And that open toe gives you a wider range of view. So depending on what you're sewing, if you need an open, open toe, but you've still got that um, need for the AccuFeed feet to feed those materials through evenly, this is a great choice for that. If you are piecing, or doing something where you'd like a smaller single hole, we do have the AccuFeed attachment available with a single hole, and this works great for quilt piecing and things of that nature. Speaking of quilting, we also have this foot right here. This foot is our quarter inch AccuFeed foot, so we can use the extra feeding um, teeth on the top of the machine as well as we've got that quarter inch flange there so you can get a nice quarter inch seam when you're piecing your, those quilt blocks together. The last foot that we have for our standard AccuFeed foot is the stitch in the ditch foot. So this one has a flange right down the middle 
which allows you to line that up along the ditch that you're sewing on for quilting and you can use this uh, with the AccuFeed foot for some really great smooth quilting options that are using a straight stitch instead of a free motion. Besides our standard AccuFeed foot, we also have our narrow AccuFeed foot and it works exactly the same. It's got the set of teeth that are engaged along the top here and it has the hook up here that go into the back of your machine when you attach it. It comes with the standard uh, regular sewing foot, but my other favorite foot that I love on this machine that you can switch out, you can pop off the regular foot and you can put on the zipper foot. And I know so many times when I sew zippers, we're sewing through multiple layers, maybe we have some interfacing in there, and being able to utilize the AccuFeed capabilities with a zipper foot is something that I absolutely love with this narrow AccuFeed foot. So you can see that no matter what you're sewing, we do have a range of options available for this AccuFeed foot as well as the ability to adjust as it's feeding through.